Hi everyone, in today's video I will show you Jordan alphabet. In previous lessons I was showing you the letters separately, we were doing reading exercises and in this one I want to present all of them, see the differences, similarities and we will, I will start from the fact that Anbani is alphabet because A is called Ani and B is called Bani so that's how we get alphabet, Anbani. We have five vowels with pink color, A, E, E, O, and U. So there are five. We have aspirated letters like P. Where is P? This is P. We have also T and K. And we have almost the same ones, but they are not the same because T. You can make it even for a longer time, like P, K. There is not like stops. And when you say K. It's just for one second. You cannot say k for a long time. The same goes for p and the same goes for t. So k and k are very similar. P and p are very similar. And t and t are very similar. I will stop here. I don't want to say more now. I will show you some unique letters that we have in Georgian that are also in other languages, but in Georgian we have a lot, like j like in word pleasure or measure, r, like in French, bonjour, we have k, k, we have z, like in English, when you have the word dad and then you want to say dads, you have a kind of like that letter, like that's, you would say, so that's z, we have z, z, we have ch, like ha, chapuri, and we have h, like hingali. I don't want you to be confused. I will show you all of them. I know that it's not super easy, but I hope that it will make sense very soon. Again, in Georgian letter alphabet, we have five vowels. A, E, E, O, U. Now let's go and see them separately. The first letter, A, has the shape of the drop. And the word with A is AI and IA. AI, IA. B, babua, babua, bebia, bali. I painted the cherry because it has the shape of cherry, I believe. G, gogo, guli, kemi. D, deda, da, drami. E, Ena, Erti, Elva, V, Vikingi, Bardi, Bashli, Z, I painted eight because it has the shape of um, eight, like before, V had the shape of three, so pay attention what is painted here. Z, Muza, Zari, Asia. T has the uh, shape of eternity symbol. Tavi, Ati, Titi. E has this shape. Italia, Ichvi, Sio. K has also the shape like three, ku, kargi, kata, lu, lomi, laimi, limoni, m, mama, mze, maimuni, n, nesvi, ananasi, panani, O, Oboba, Otri, Otahi, P, Papa, Pizza, Amidori, J, Jolo, Jasmini, Jele, R, Rugby, Raketa, Radio, S, Salati, 
soko, sandwichi, tu, tomi, torti, tango, u, puli, guli, suli, p, panta, peria, prani, k, kali, kari, kapi, r, pay attention that it looks like heart in this part, robe, rori, rimili, k, looks like um, y, English y, so like epsilon, tkali, tkvavili, pakaki, Shu, Sharpi, Shvili, Shveli. Chu looks like H. Chai, Chiri, Chiti. Tsu, Tsa, Pizza, Tsunami. Dzu looks like English D. Zagli, Zma. Zala. Tsu. Tsali. Tsamali. Tsitila. Chu. Hachapuri. Pichi. Chia. Hu looks like English B. He. Heli. Hink Ali. Ju. Jemi. Jami. Jazzy. Who is the last letter of Georgian alphabet? This is very beautiful letter, I believe. And the words with who is Hava, Havai, Havana. It's not very common letter. Mostly it's with verbs. And so you will not see it very often. Also with expressions, we say who very often. Now let's see the letters that look like each other. The first ones, I believe that B and G look like each other. The difference is that B goes up and the top is different, and G goes down and also the top is different, it's round. It also, I would say, it looks like English G. Then V, K, P, and H look like each other. V looks like exactly like three. K is not so round on the top. P is not also so round on the top and it goes up and the difference between pu and hu you see it's like pu goes up two times while hu does this for one two three times this is v this is k this is pu and this is hu then we have v and g the difference is that v is open while g is closed two and O are also similar, just you close the first part of v O to get T. Like O looks like English M, while T looks like eternity symbol. Then we have another group of letters. L, one, two, three. D, one, two. And R, that is completely open, while D can be closed. R is very similar to heart shape. Like if I was closing here, I would have R sound, R letter. Then we have mirrors, as I call them. T and SH. And it's very common to make the mistake between these two. Even Georgians make mistake here. This is T that is open on the right and SH that is open on the left. Then we have M and N that are also very similar. And then we have H and Z. H goes on the right while Z goes on the left. It's like the difference between do and do. Also remember that if you make the mistake here, this is not the end of the world because also Georgian make this mistake. That's all for today. I hope it was interesting for you. I hope it was useful for you. Don't uh, forget to click on subscribe button. So like this, you can always get the notification when I upload something new. And if you know that someone is interested to learn Georgian language, you can share it. So like this, um, more people are able to see and learn Georgian language. Thank you and see you in the next video. Bye, bye.